Look at my friend. A little, pe a little oh, petting yeah. zoo. He doesn't. <laughs> you like that kitty, buddy? Oh, isn't it nice? <laughs> Buddy, what do you think? Fish. What do you think you're doing? Hey, sit down on there, please. A fish. Yeah, is that your fish? Is that your vlog from yesterday? Okay, let's get down. Are you? You wanna go aside, Francois? You wanna go aside? Huh? You ready to go out, buddy? There you go. Sorry, Niles. Niles is not allowed to go outside anymore because he's dumb and he went and got hit by a car a month or so ago, so he has to stay inside now. But Francois is a good boy. He stays on the property and doesn't really go too far. All right, I'm gonna feed Fishimus Prime and see if he finds these pellets. Here you go, little dude. I guess it's just sitting there at the top. Let's give him two. Here it is over here, Fishimus. Gobble that up, it's right there. There you go. Yeah. Did he eat it? Oh, I think he did. Oh, he's he's gobbling it right up. Let's do another one now that he's now that he's got that feeding frenzy behavior. Oh, he took it. Nice. Good Fishimus Prime. There it goes. That's right, buddy. Ooh, mommy. Look at that footage. He's a good fish. You gotta pick it up. Good job. Are you doing your wheelbarrow, buddy? Huh? Oh, I don't think we're gonna do the water right now, buddy. We had a lot of rain yesterday. I don't want you to get your pants wet, okay? Hey, come here, buddy. All right, let's get out of here, okay? Don't she get any kind of poison ivy? Hey, what's Niles doing out here? Niles, yeah. you're not allowed to come out here because you get hit by cars. Bad cat. He must have got out. I thought I locked him in the basement, but he must have been hiding in another room. Bad cat. All right, Munchkin, let's go. Let's go on the swing, okay? The, the lawn is really long and it's all dewy, so we're probably gonna get all soaked. Soaked sock. You wanna go on the slide? Okay, give me a walk up. Three. Hold on tight, okay? Hold on tight up there. Hold on tight. I think the slide might be a little bit wet this morning. You didn't go down on your bum? No. No? He probably won't even feel it with his diaper. You smart cookie. Are you turning the hose on? Are you gonna water the garden now? Well, I guess I could put the hose on for him. No harm if he gets wet. I'll just change his pants. I'm not sure why, but he just likes to water the tree for some reason. Oh, check out this bug. That's a weird bug. What? Look. I can't even tell what kind of bug that is. It's not a bee. I don't think. Watch out. Maybe it is some kind of bee. There's our, those are the two cats out there hanging out in the grass. And hopefully Niles will stay close. Haha. <laughs>
Don't sit down, it's all wet, buddy. Well, we're back inside. It was a short little outing. Um, our property is kind of a pain because there's no fence for Xavier to play like inside. And we have like poison ivy pretty much all over the edge of the property and stuff. So it's, it's a hassle. We're constantly holding his hand and making sure that he doesn't run off to those areas. But that's all he wants to do because he's a toddler. He wants to run around and play. So I really wish we had like a fence and like an area that he could just play and not have to be like hounded by us you know, annoying him and telling him not to go there, or pulling him away from that. So, uh, one day when we get another house, uh, definitely I'm going to want a fence. Maybe even get one here before we move out in a couple years, I don't know. What are you looking at, buddy? Is that your fishy? Is that your pet fishy over there? A, B, C, D, E, F, G. H I J K Oh L M N O P Q R S T U V W X Y Z Can you sing it? It is Scott. Is it? Hey buddy. Where are we going? Have two dogs. We're gonna go see two dogs and our friends that have the dogs. What do you think? You gonna see them and have fun? Yeah. Have two dogs? That's right, they have two dogs. Xavier's meeting the pets and now he's playing with toys. we visited we haven't seen them in a while they have two kids but they're quite a bit older than um, Xavier is right now right that's right uh, and it's mostly like we met these guys because our friend John was uh, the kung fu instructor when we were doing kung fu and Filipino martial arts kung fu? that's right and so we're friends with John and his wife and then his two kids who are what nine and what 12 13 something like that yeah they're really cool so it's a good time. Yeah, and uh, they were kind of en kind enough to invite us over for dinner. They were ordering calzones, but we had to decline because Tom has his food sensitivities and I'm on a diet. But I so much regret. I wanted that calzone <laughs> so bad. Oh, I wanted that oh, calzone. And they but smell so good too. You'll have to bury me in the backyard oh with goodness. all that gluten. I'm regretting my uh, diet thing right now. Just make a delicious calzone for cheat day. I might have to. I was kind of thinking I just wanted to get all this stuff to make like a huge sundae. <laughs> I don't know. We'll see. But it was nice seeing them again. So if you guys watch this, it was cool seeing you. And we hope that we can uh, meet up again soon. Xavier really seemed to like your place and he was well behaved. So that's always a plus. Yeah, he was a good boy over there. It's nice because a lot of times he'll be shy. But he was actually hanging out and he liked seeing their pets. And it was good. Yeah, you got to feed the pets as you guys saw. So that was fun for him. So now we're gonna go home and get some food and settle down. 
All right, back home now. Got everyone set up with dinner. Poor kid was so hungry. He was sitting next to our friend's daughter, like thinking he was gonna get some calzone. So we got him that, and I'm eating this. Some delicious, amazing drumsticks that my uh, father-in-law, who we call Gramps, uh, smoked in the smoker uh, over the weekend. So I've been enjoying those leftovers, it's so good. I need him to like smoke me drumsticks like all the time. The fish? The fish? Yes. Do you want to explain to him the, about the food? Here's what we're gonna do. Okay, check it out. Ready? Watch, buddy. Xavier, here. Do you want to sit on the counter for a minute? And here's what we're gonna do. Okay. You're gonna sit right here. And we have. Okay, you sneeze. You don't need the spoon. Hold on. I think you could do it like this. Can you? Can you pick up this fish food with your fingers? You want to use the spoon? Okay. Water spoon? Yep. Now using the spoon, hold on, hold it flat. Can you can you dump that food into the water right here? Oh, there you go. I think. No, I nope, just felt it didn't in my toes. Can you dump that food into the water? Don't put it all the way. Just dump it out. Shake it. Yep. Hold it over and shake. Why? Here, I got another idea. Hold your hand up. Hold your hand up like this. Here's the food <laughs> for the fish. He's allergic to Can the you fish. Dump that in the water. Now is it stuck to his hand? <laughs> can you push it off your hand? Put it in the water. We're gonna put the food in the spoon, and then you can dump the food out for the fish. Okay, dump it out in there. There you go. Good job. Now we'll see if he eats it. He's on the wrong side. Let's do another food. Tell him okay, to put dump it. Good okay. job. Now we see if the fish he's gonna find it. Okay. Is he gonna find it? Can you watch patiently? Let's see if do you see the food floating right there? He's gonna get Look, it. He's coming closer. Oh, he didn't get it. Here it goes. Oh he ate it. He got a different piece. Here you go. All right, I'm wrapping up the vlog. We had a pretty fun day. It was fun going to see our friends and hopefully we can see them again soon. And I've got the place all picked up. So I'm ready to do some editing and get this vlog up for tomorrow. So stay tuned and see you guys. Don't forget to subscribe.